Hi everybody, welcome back. I, I cut my finger. Um, Jim has another interview, and I'm not gonna tell you where, but it rhymes with Lendy's. <laughs> he actually has an interview tomorrow as well, so it'll be three interviews in two days, which is awesome. Thank you all for all of your prayers. I know he jumped on his channel yesterday. I know a lot of you aren't subscribed to him, but some people do actually watch. Um, he jumped on yesterday to thank everybody for all their prayers because it really has helped. Um, and I want to do that as well. I wanted to thank you all for your love and consideration. Um, I posted two really quick videos, one on Instagram that will get shared to Facebook um, in the Facebook story, in the Insta story, and one to um, YouTube on the community page. I actually posted it on my page and then redirected everybody to the community tab. So if you click on my face um, and you if you click on my face, it brings you to my page. And on my page are tabs that say home, video, playlist, community, and then such on, and about, and all those things. Well, if you click on the community tab, I often post, not often, I frequently post, <laughs> it's, not, it's not that frequent or often, I occasionally post polls or announcements for live streams. Um, I don't know that I'm going to pre-announce live streams anymore. I think you'll have to like keep your bell rung, your push notifications on because if we do live streams from now on, it'll probably be surprised because of the situation in the past. Until things calm down a little bit, let's just try a few live streams, um, surprise live streams and see what happens. Anyhow, that all being said to say this. I posted a video on my Insta stories on all the different social medias to poll about um, merch. Would you guys be interested in if I designed some Jerry Ann Henson, Henson Family t-shirts, um, would you guys be interested in buying them? Uh, that would also be a way that you could be part of the family, well, show off that you're part of the family, help the channel grow, as well as help support me and Jim in a way that's not just gifting us money, you actually get something in return. There have been a few different options people have suggested to us. One of them is like, not selling services, but like uh, auctioning off FaceTime or uh, selling, I know, you know, I know I'm weary about selling the goods. Uh, we may do like, uh, stickers and my design stickers with different sayings that I love of my own like personal designs but there's actually a new one that I love it's like um, choose joy but then joy spells out uh, Jesus others and yourself um, because when you think about um, for me as a Christian anyway when I think about uh, prioritizing those that people in that order um, then that's really uh, what makes my life so fulfilled and so happy is when you always put others first. Um, it sort of does really make you happy. You do have to take care of yourself as well or else you can't care for others. And um, we know that as well as caregivers. Um, I actually was just messaging with somebody a few days ago where um, we used the, um, the analogy about when you're on a plane um, and you, uh, oxygen mask drops, they always tell you to, um, put it on yourself before you assist some, assist others is really what it is. Because you can't help people if you're not capable of it. If you're incapacitated, you can't help others. So I kind of said to her, um, I really wish I would have known that back in 2006. In 2006, my, um, my father got sick and had a slew of medical issues for uh, almost the four years up until he passed. Um, it was just a few months shy of four years he started all of his, you know, like from the start of his ailments to um, to when he passed. But if I would have known that uh, now, or if I would have realized it then, I should say, um, it would have probably been better for me because I went undiagnosed. My I had type I had okay. Let me put it this way: I had symptoms that I know now were from having type two diabetes, but I didn't go diagnosed for four years um, because I 
was so busy taking care of him. And that's true about the, the analogy is the analogy is you cannot, sorry, I just made myself really dark. Whoa, whoa. The, um, whoa. <laughs> Let me fix that. Oh my goodness. What is happening? Okay. Oh, oh. How about we just tap on my nose and just freeze it there? I hope that's okay. Um, the analogy of not um, taking care of myself really did affect my uh, my my body, my future health. Um, not knowing for four years and not treating or um, even with diet, like I didn't even do anything special to my diet other than going on my you know my regular eating habits that I always did. Um, I didn't do anything for four years um, until he passed, and then I was like, okay, time to take care of myself. Um, which wasn't good and I don't recommend it. But other than that, putting others first, um, and I really mean about self, selfish sort of things, not your medical health, not your medical conditions, but like your, your wants and needs. If you put others first, how you're in service of each other, we're in service of humanity. Um, those types of things is what they're referring to as others. And then yourself being last. So, um, if you're a mom, you know this. If you have, you know, if you're a selfless person, you know this. If you're a teacher even, you know, you know that you're not there every day to just make a paycheck. You're there every day to teach a human being how to be a better human being. Okay. So... <laughs> One of the things I also asked you <laughs> in the polls were if you have a favorite uh, Jerryism is what I named them, but basically something that I say a lot or that you like or you think it's funny. Um, I immediately went to Bob's Your Uncle because when I've said it in videos before and I kind of say it a lot, um, people often comment about it in the comments. But um, if you have something. Um, then definitely let me know. In the comments of this would be great. Also in the comments of this video, let me know um, if you haven't gone over to the poll, um, if you're having trouble finding where the poll is, um, if you have any other suggestions, um, definitely let me know. Um, but like I was saying, other suggestions were given to me as well and they're all good suggestions. I feel like though that for right now the way that I'm doing daily videos daily DIYs and adding um, multiple time a week vlogs it's really consuming so doing anything extra like one-on-one uh, -on -one FaceTiming or um, one-on-one -on -one tutorials even live stream tutorials they're, they're just a lot more work than I have time to do. And I know that that sounds so lazy to me. Like, yeah, I have time to sit in the car and support my husband. But yeah, I have time to sit in the car and support my husband. I busted my butt over the weekend so that I could be here for Jim. Um, because Jim drives all over town. He has no problem doing that. But when he gets anxious before an, uh, an interview, as many people do, and not anxious always in a bad way, anxious, excited, and anxious, he'll, his mind doesn't always focus on the driving part, which is why he doesn't deliver, because then he gets excited when he's delivering and trying to find directions and anything. That's why he's not like a delivery guy, is what I'm saying. So, mm. Anyhow... All of that to say this, thank you all for encouraging us to grow the channel, to encouraging us to um, find better ways to support the family, and encouraging us with your love and support. You guys have no idea what kind of encouragement it gives to my heart to keep doing this every day. Um, I was like almost to the edge of being burnt out on creating the other day, and I was like, you guys really, and, and I hate to sound like sappy about it, but you guys were really the inspiration just to keep going. You were the motivation. And I was like, well, I can't let them down and I don't have anything ready. And so I sat up till I have usually post at midnight, 12.01 a.m. Um, but, ooh, 
That kid looked like he was going to fall on his tuchus. I'm sorry. Um, I usually post till 12.01 a.m. So sometimes I'm up and just uploading at like 11.58. So I have like three minutes to make it go live. So I thank you all for your encouragement and your support. You really don't have any idea how much it means to me. All right. So I hope that I continue, can continue to be here for you like you guys are for me. All right. All right. Thanks so everybody. I love you and take care. God bless. And we'll see you next time. weird um the screen just went totally black you guys can still see me oh that's so bright what happened here we go try that in. yeah my screen just went totally black i know you guys can see me but anyway i wonder if it's getting hot might be getting hot in the sun um oh boy that's a that's a hot phone